Hey, welcome back, Gary Brown Fortune Hunt. Glad you could be here today, and want to talk about some stuff I'm going to be doing for my. I'm just, I was going to do a giveaway at 300, 400, 500, and I'm already up over 570. Uh, I've just been laid up with all the surgeries. I'm going to do my 500 uh, sub giveaway, even though it's been a little while ago. Uh, but I'm happy I reached there, and I'm so thankful and blessed and I appreciate everybody that has uh, joined and watched and uh, hopefully I can make some good content that might help somebody out somewhere different different aspects of things so today I'm going to talk about the giveaway um, this is what I'm giving away I've got two of these uh, tool holders I'm gonna give one out I'm gonna give another one out and uh, I'll uh, make a uh, put a link up here in the card or down in the description, one of the two, of me making these, and also I will um, I'll put a link up here about me making them and uh, and put some uh, it tells how to make it and how uh, made these were actually started from uh, uh, Billy McCollum. I did another video. I'll, Go back a long time ago. I'll really find it and put it up here too. <clears throat> but Billy and Gabby, um, a couple of good friends that they started taking the blacksmithing class, the green coal class, a little bit after I did. And um, they, uh, they, well, they started while I was doing it. Uh, it. It took like five, six months to get through it. And then Billy got really into it. He was retired and uh, kind of retired. He stayed real busy for somebody retired. And then, um, but he was always teaching two, three nights a week up at, the, up at our blacksmith club. And he was also teaching them, doing demonstrations at events, and he was just making things for people. And he'd make these and bring them to the iron and a hat, and I've won some of his. And so um, he passed away about a year, year and a half ago, heart attack. Miss Billy, but they started, it was Billy and Joe McDonald that um, had uh done a lot of work for the shop over over the years and uh, of the blacksmith club and so they started a scholarship fund in their name and so I, what I'm going to do is I'm giving these away but I'm going to put some up for sale and I'm going to keep making them put them out there uh, I may put them out there as a, like a order thing instead of making them and having them out there I'm going to see how they sell um, I need to come up with a better way to make them this is very time consuming and um uh, I don't have a plasma torch, and to cut these holes out, I had to uh, basically these are three quarter inch washers, and I made a drift, three quarter, uh, one inch drift, and I cut the holes out, and I punched them through, and then I had to flatten them, and so it's kind of you know rough, but they do the job, and then you put your tool in there, your punch in there, and your punches only have to be you know short like this that way, and you can just hold them and hit. And uh, I keep my touch mark in one of them, and then I can use the others for, and I can make small punches instead of having to make big long punches. Um, I, I still have long punches too that I like to use, but if, you, especially if I get a treble, uh, treadle hammer built, uh, this is, these are real handy in the treadle hammer. And, um, but anyway, as I sell them, I'm going to um, have any profits from making them. After I cover all my costs, I'll have any profits left over. I'm going to donate all that to the Billy McCullough to that scholarship fund for the blacksmithing yeah. through the club. So I'm going to give this one away. I'm going to give this one away. And like I said, they're a little on the cruder side uh, just because I'm, I'm my, I've done four of these. I'm going to put the other two out on Etsy. But um, they're my first ones I've made. And so I'm going to give them away in the 500 people auction. Uh, 500 subscriber auction and also I created some merchandise <laughs> and so that's kind of a new thing to me and so I've got a coffee mug with my logo on it <clears throat> the logo's in the middle and then that little phrase don't wait make build create something I just I like supporting the maker community but it's uh uh, coffee cup and um, I got ones out on uh, 
on uh, Teespring. I'll put a link below. And I got some, you know, I put some shirts and some um, some other things out there, and I forgot now what all. <clears throat> I just put this logo on them, and uh, and I'll give a, a sticker uh, to uh, along with everything that people get. So to be part of this, um, I don't have a live. I can't do live stream unless I do it in the house. I don't have Wi-Fi. I can't even get a cell signal inside this metal building, but. Uh, <clears throat> I don't have Wi-Fi out here yet. I'm going to hopefully get some sometime, but it's going to be a while. So be a part of the 500 subscriber uh, giveaway. I don't want to do in honor of Billy, but I made these in honor of. Just go in there and you can type any comments you want, but anywhere in the comment, just put the word Billy, B-I-L-L-Y, and then I will go through them all and pick each person. Um, I may give it till sometime next week. After this airs, I'll give it like a, you know, about four or five days, six days. Just depends on when I get around to it again. And I'll make another video of me drawing them. Either picking a number, I'll put a number with each one and draw, you know, have a random number generator going. Or I'll uh, just put the names in a hat and pull them out. Just one entry per person. Um, you know, that's, that'll be it. And, uh, and I'll ship it to you. I'll, you know, wherever you're at, that's fine. Um, and hopefully, um, you know, we can keep going and you'll enjoy the content and keep growing the channel. And like I said, you know, subscribe, ring the bell and do all that and leave some comments and <clears throat> tell me if there's something else you want to see me do. Uh, and that's about it. Um, hope you all have a blessed day and we'll talk to you later. Bye bye now.